What is the first piece of art you ever created? Or, or, or maybe what's the first piece of art you ever experienced, saw, listened well, to? Well, I, Picasso, I liked him and Van Gogh, I believe. Vincent Van Gogh, Pablo Picasso. Yeah, but my favorite is, is Picasso. I, and I, I did try to do a painting. I did it in oil. I did a self-portrait of myself. And I don't know, I yeah. wanted to see half of me. Okay. It was like split down in the middle. Okay. This side you couldn't see, but this side you could see. Wow. And I, and then people would come over and they said, who is that supposed to be? That's supposed to be you? That's what makes you think about it. Why do you think that it's supposed to be me? Uh, what, and then he would say, well, I don't know. Well, you must have thought it was me because you recognize it. Uh, there's a local artist. You didn't get it there. Wait, you must have thought it was me, but you didn't recognize it. Yeah, but what I'm saying is that why would he ask me, is that supposed to be you? What gave you the idea that it's supposed to be me? It must look like me. Yeah. My point. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, you did a good job. But the people would say, my friends, I said, would say, who is that supposed to be? That's supposed to be you? You know? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of judgmental, yeah. Well, why would you say it, it like that? Yeah. Who that's supposed to be? It must be me. I'm of trying course. to be me because you gave what gave you the indication that it, it's supposed to be me. They couldn't be congratulatory. They had to. That's what I'm, my point I was trying to bring out. Sneak a, a j j jab. Yeah, in there. but yeah. So I did a little painting to that. But uh, I used to come down um, with Wayne, some to cry from Wayne State University, John Sinclair, because his wife, Lena, I think she was an artist. And Sherry yeah. Keywell, Florence Keywell niece, was an artist. She, I got pictures that she did, those pictures she did. And um, I was into art a little bit, and I wanted to do that. And, and I like Picasso. Oh, okay, so that, okay, I'm curious. I, I, know, I think you just said it, but I'm sorry. How did you get, how did you acquire the oil? How did you get the idea? Because of, because of John Sinclair, all those people just well, inspired you? Well, uh, Sherry Keywell was an artist. And she went to art school at Wayne State. And by looking at her drawing things like that, well, they, her crowd, they was together, and I was mixed with that crowd too. If they can do it, you can do it. No, but I got interested in it by hanging with them. Yeah. Who was the artist? Uh, here, here's here's a, a tangential, you know, kind of connected question. You know, you mess around with music. You you know, what, 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 between filming folks, this this fella. You're, you're practicing um, uh, uh, My Way by, by Frank Sinatra, because we're going to play that one day on camera, hopefully not too long. Mm -hmm. And and you also you play the piano, you're trying to noodle on the guitar, you play the recorder, you play the uh, drum, the brush drumsticks. I mean, you even have a musical, uh, what do you call it, um, a musical pendant on your uh, your, your your necklace, that, that, that saxophone. A saxophone? Oh, it's a... But, but okay, so I'm saying, uh, art. It, you've you've never shied away from trying to make any kind of art. Well, I I didn't have art in school. We, I don't think that we had art in our school. I didn't come through that. But I'm saying that. Yeah. See other people doing things, it rubs off on me if I get interested in it. Yeah, and but that, but and, uh, also at the same time, I think other people. You're saying it rubs off on you. Yeah, I'm sure a lot of people would be inspired. But you you went the extra mile and went and made your own stuff. I mean, I, and I, I'm saying you never were bashful about trying new things like that. You just would dive in. Other people, would, you know, the paralysis of analysis. Oh, it's not good enough. But you would just go out and do something. I like to be creative. Creative. I just I don't know. Well, like yeah. I said, the crowd you hang with sometimes makes what you become. Visual artists and musical artists. And yeah. I see, I was around jazz and music. I like that. I wanted to be like that. I, I pick up the, the swagger that they have. Could you describe that portrait again? And before you do, there is a local artist that I, I suppose they say the, the finest fine arts school in all of America is Yale Fine Arts School. And a graduate of Yale is a local Detroit artist. He's a, a black man named Mario Moore, and he's got uh, he's he's got work on display right now in downtown Detroit at uh, the David Klein Gallery. He's had work displayed there for years. Mm -hmm. 
excellent artist. I've been to at least one of his openings. Excellent. So I want Mario Moore to recreate that painting because I, 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 I forgot that you made that painting. So could you describe it? And then I'll, I'll tag Mario Moore. And, and who, know, he, who knows? He I might be inspired. I think I got a photograph at it at home yeah. with some pictures there. I got See if it. he can I, recreate it. Yeah. yeah, because the color was black. Okay. And it's, it was a pinkish or something. It was a different color. And the way I did the brush, the movement. Anyway, I thought it was good. You could see you can see the other side. Well, like I got the idea from Picasso because he painted a, a, a lady's face. And you can see this side and that side at the same time. I, that's still one of my favorite paintings that he has done, Picasso. And so was it sort of in that cubism sort of kind of cartoonish style or was it more realistic depiction of your face or half Wait. of it was cubist and half was realistic? Well, well, that's the way he did, he did it. No, for you, for me, your, your painting. Yeah, what did it look like? Well, it, you can see this, this. It was like in a shadow. This side, you just see half my place, and, and my, I was, you know, like in there. I don't know why why I wanted to do that. I don't remember. I got to see the picture again and analyze. Did it, you know? use uh, true to life colors? Or did you use any crazy colors like I had, purple? I, I had skin? some oil. I bought some oil and painted up on Woodward. Yeah. At the, Paint that at that time you that's where the artist went. I got the brushes. Yeah. I got all that stuff. Oh, over uh you know there's Blick Art Store. Was there an art store in that same location or was it somewhere just else on Woodward? Because I know down Woodward, no Woodward Midtown. In the Boulevard. Yeah, in Midtown on Woodward is an art store. I wonder if it's the same one. I Maybe not. Well they years. they moved from that they no yeah. longer there at the time because it was the next door to uh, Popeye Chicken. Not next door in that same block. Yeah. Because there used to be a jewelry store there too that's because uh, that's why I had my rain. The girl, the lady who worked there at the time, I drew the rain, and she had it made for me. Man. And it came out just like I wanted. Then, you know. You designed that ring yourself right there. Yes. Hey, you want you want to just kind of hold it up like this, like uh, right 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 here, because there's a camera kind of close up on you, and hopefully well, it's it'll. A record. Really, it's a record. It's your logo, yeah. It's my logo, but it's a record behind the logo. That's beautiful. And with the 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 black part, the label, with it's black onyx. So you know, they, they, there we go. We're talking about art. You you designed your own jewelry. <laughs> I yeah. mean, you just you designed your own clothing. Uh, you did well. Not logo, the logo. Well, I did. Yeah, I used my logo on clothing. And put on some things that I had already bought, like cashmere sweaters. You designed your own record displays. Right. Ah!